For the Chick Egg Cozy, we are using 4mm knitting needles and any yarn or wool of double knitting DK weight. To start the main body of the Chick Egg Cozy, make a slip knot. Then cast on 22 stitches. Once you've casted on all stitches, knit for 14 rows. Once you've finished 14 rows, you now want to knit row 15. So row 15 is knit 1, knit 2 together, knit 3, knit 2 together, knit 6, knit 2 together, knit 3, knit another 2 together, and then finally knit 1 stitch. And then for row 16, knit all stitches. For row 17, knit 1, knit 2 stitches together, knit 2, then knit 2 together, knit 4, knit 2 stitches together, knit 2, knit 2 together, and then finally knit 1 stitch. Then for row 18, knit all stitches. The next row is row 19. So you want to knit one stitch, knit two together, knit one stitch, knit two together, knit two, knit two stitches together, knit one stitch, knit two more stitches together and then knit the final stitch. For row 20, knit all stitches. For row 21, knit one stitch, knit two stitches together until the final stitch and then knit the last stitch.
Row 22, knit all stitches. Cut the yarn, leaving a long end. Thread the yarn. And then thread through all stitches on the needle. Draw up tightly and then fasten off. And now you want to sew up the side of the main body. Turn the knitting inside out. To make the first wing, cast on three stitches. For the first row, knit one, knit into the front and back of the next stitch and then knit another stitch. Knit the next row. For row 3, knit 1, KFB, KFB, knit 1. For row 4, knit all stitches. For row 5, knit 1, knit 2 together, knit 2 together, and knit the last stitch. And then to finish, cast off all stitches. Cut the yarn and thread through the last stitch. Now you've made your first wing, make an identical second one. To make the beak, make a slip knot and cast on four stitches. Then knit six rows. Once you've knitted all six rows, cast off all stitches. Then cut the yarn, leaving a long end. Thread through the last stitch on the needle. Draw up tightly and fast enough. Sew on the first eye using a chain stitch. Insert the needle from the inside up and through the knitting and pull through. Then insert the needle into the stitch you just came through and push the tip out through the stitch to the right. Wrap the long end of the yarn around the needle and pull the needle fully through the stitch. Then insert the needle into the stitch that you just came through and pull the needle down through the inside of the knitting. That's the eye finished. Make a second eye a few stitches to the right. For the beak, we're going to thread the long tail of yarn from the cast off end along the cast off row. So now you want to fold the beak diagonally to form a triangle and then use the end of the yarn to sew the edge of the beak closed. Now turn the beak over and sew the second edge of the beak closed. We're now going to sew the beak onto the chick egg cosy.
Once that's done, we're going to sew in all of the ends. Next we will sew both wings onto either side of the egg cosy. And that is the Chick Egg Cozy finished. Now for the Bunny Egg Cozy, we will knit up the main body as before in pink. Now to make the bunny ears, cast on 7 stitches. Now knit the first 10 rows. For row 11, slip one stitch, then knit one stitch, and then pass the slip stitch over, and then SKPO again, then knit three together. Then cut the yarn, leaving a long end, then thread this long end through all of the stitches. So now that you've made the first ear, go and make a second identical one. So now we're going to sew on the eyes in the same way as the Chick Egg Cozy. Next we will sew on the mouth, so about six rows below the eyes, push the needle up and through the knitting, then insert the needle down into a stitch up and to the left. Push back up through the previous stitch, then insert the needle down into a stitch up to the right and push it back up through the previous stitch. Then sew in the ends. Next we're going to fold the ear in half along the cast on row and sew the cast on row closed. Then we will sew the ear to the top right hand side of the egg cosy so that it points upwards. And then sew the second ear onto the opposite side of the egg cosy. And finally we're going to add a nose. And now we have finished the bunny egg cosy. Now for the lamb egg cosy, we will knit up the main body as before in a different yarn. And afterwards we'll make up two ears the same as for the bunny. Then we'll sew along the cast on edges of the ears as before. Next we'll sew the first ear onto the cosy so it sticks out. Then sew in all the ends and add the second ear to the opposite side. Sew on the eyes as before. Sew on the mouth as for the bunny. Then insert the needle down through a stitch one row below and pull through to the inside. And that is the Lamb Egg Cozy finished. If you'd like to find more of our patterns, uh, subscribe below or visit our website at janeswool.co.uk for more information.